morning, good morning, good morning, and welcome back to our channel. Um, it is officially the six weeks holidays for Seth and Elijah. <laughs> Grace and Reuben have gone off to school today. Uh, they've only got half a day though, so not very long at all. But yeah, I thought I would come on and vlog. I have um, not been very good with the vlogging lately, only because end of year it's just been a bit manic and we've had loads of like gym displays and just loads of different stuff going on at the moment so I just haven't I have been picking up the camera but I just haven't really been editing and I just didn't feel like there was like a full vlog to put together so I just didn't do it but plans through the holidays so obviously like many people this channel is for memories for us it's not anything other than making memories we was watching back some christmas vlogs the other day yes christmas in july get used to it i talk about christmas a lot um and it just made me realize how much i 100 percent don't want to stop vlogging because looking back at the kids when they were little oh my god i am eternally grateful that i started this and i have those memories because it's just the cutest thing and the most special thing. So I am going to be vlogging through the summer holidays. Um, I won't be daily vlogging. <laughs> yes, I've done that before. I won't be daily vlogging and I'm not going to do like a weekend weekly vlog either. It's just going to be probably every three days um, I'll upload whatever we're up to. We do have a holiday book. And um, we're going to Cornwall, which is super exciting. Uh, we've never, we, me and Adam have been to Cornwall. We've been to Newquay, 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 um, before children. But we've never taken the kids to Cornwall. And Grace has been going on and on and on about it. So we're going to St Ives Bay and we're stopping at Haven which we're very excited about it's like a budget holiday because obviously we've already been to Ireland this year which Centre Park's quite an expensive holiday so we're just doing a bit of a budget trip down to Cornwall in a nice bronze caravan hopefully it's fine it's somewhere to put our heads and I'm hoping that we're going to spend the majority of the time on the beach just enjoying the beach because apparently it's meant to be absolutely amazing the I'll, I'll write the name here because I don't know if I'm going to pronounce it right, but the B Batista, 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 it's like B-A-T-T-I-S-A -T -T -I -I vlogs, they're a family vlog and they've just been down there, they've got like a camper van, they stopped on a different haven site, but oh my goodness, they made it look amazing, so um, that's what we're going to be doing at the end of August, so we've got a little bit of a wait, I haven't made any plans for the holidays, now I, I, I normally have at least at least three weeks worth of plans for the summer holidays but I haven't made any plans this year mainly because a lot of the people we have plans with have conflicting holidays with us um, they're like going away at the beginning of the holidays where we're going away at the end of the holidays and just things like that really so I am going to do days out but it's not going to be like planned days it'll be like hashtag last minute days kind of thing the only day I think 4th of August I've got something planned oh that's my husband he's working great I'm going to talk to him for a moment <laughs> hello right I finished chatting <laughs> it was working away last night so he's just ringing for a chat um so yeah so that's our sort of semi plans for the holidays as in we have none but I'm going to vlog through the memories of whatever we do whether we have pool days or whether or not we go out and meet friends or just for a walk and stuff like that and I'm hoping to have I really want to go to Cheddar Gorge my sister went there again recently she said it is really good very 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 touristy now but she still said it was really good and worth the day out so I might try and do that at some point but I feel like Adam needs to come on that day <laughs> um just because I don't like doing big family days out without Adam because I just think it's like an experience for us all to have together but we'll definitely be daily vlogging our holiday because I want it for the memories but today because it's the first day and Grace and Reuben are still um at school me and the boys are gonna i'm gonna have a whiz around and tidy up a little bit and then i'm gonna do a little bit of baking with the little boys we've had lots of christmas things on at the moment 
<laughs> so large reason these crystals for sure he's been really loving it as well but i just need to vac throw so i just need to get everything off the floor before i do that and then we're going to do some baking right we are starting to bake here's my little christmas boy <laughs> <laughs> we've got christmas vlogs on because it is miserable here today i'm not even joking it's raining it's dull it's considering it was what 37 degrees on Mon monday tuesday 36 i think i think 36 was our maximum temperature but considering that and then today it feels cold like i've got joggers on wait how much how much is it 14 degrees. So we're doing cheap baking to start with today. So I brought out one of these and I'm actually just going to leave it completely up to the boys today to read the instructions completely on their own. Because this morning is flying. I need to actually... Um, <laughs> that's slightly terrifying. I need to crack on with getting some tidying done. I'm slightly terrified. <laughs> Oh, okay. Yeah. Somebody needs to empty all the cupcake cases out into the tray. All I need is 500 grams. Okay, how many cakes are you making? You'll make the cupcakes, so you'll make quite a few. Right, you don't need to work on 6,000 grams. No, you just need to literally follow the instructions. How much oil have you got to work? Oil? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I need 500 grams of cake mix and which you've got 200 millilitres of water and 60 okay so where's the measuring tub that i gave 60 you 60 millimetres of um vinegar oil no. really easy baking today i just wanted them to have something to do while Grace and ruben were still at school um there is an orange cake mix oh my god it smells amazing and then i've got some look what i've got to put under mm -hmm. chocolate and valencian orange frosting but Elijah won't have any of that because he doesn't like icing. <laughs> so she can have a plum. That's plum. fine. That is fine. I did a big share board yesterday to treat them when they come out of school. <coughs> mm, bless me. I'll put a photo in now of it and um there's still a few little bits left over which i've been munching on all morning i've also been um i've sorted some of the boys wardrobe out as well and just got i've just got rid of like loads of pajamas that don't fit them and um some uniform that we won't be having anymore and i think that was about it really there wasn't loads i need to really go through it i think seth's got about 
eight hoodies in his wardrobe because they've been like passed down. I've just polished all of my canvases but I need to as I was polishing I'm not that and that's fell down so I need to just go around and redo that. Grace has just messaged me she's like you picking me up in the car aren't you because it's chucking it down. I was like okay that's fine I can do that. Cakes are nearly done. Right school's out ah, for summer we're so excited. Right these are finishing this off now. Bryce is making us a pot noodle because that's how we roll and this yes please it's one star each score with pop um and these are gonna finish decorating these make sure you leave some for Elijah to decorate chocolate orange yeah you can leave these two decorating so um yeah i ended up doing it but then somebody else had one and then it's got knocked so now they're like just mixed together but this is like chocolate orange spread as well so it all tastes amazing but yeah that's all done i'm about to start dinner we're a little bit early for dinner um so we shouldn't really be having dinner yet but we all really fancy dippy eggs and toast which I know is breakfast but I'm gonna have some dippy eggs and then Grace wants a mixture pig in a cup which I used to have all the time when I was little um so that's what I'm gonna do now I'm gonna get some I think I need to check that I've got enough eggs I don't know if I've got enough eggs let's have a look I've got dum, da, da, dum, three there I've got two boxes of eggs open for some reason I don't know why feels quite heavy which is promising and I've got oh yeah I've got loads I've got loads I've got a full pack of eggs well it's not full I don't know why I got mixed up like I don't know why I've took three out there when I still had a box open Adam's gonna be a little bit later tonight he's had to he's left one job and then he's had to go for an induction another job so we can get on there nice and early on monday he's working at pinewood studios which is i believe where they, they film mission impossible and stuff like that so it's a very exciting as well and interesting fact adam um adam's company did the uh, stadium for the commonwealth games at alexander stadium and adam's was offered rehe the rehearsal the opening the re the opening of the commonwealth games show but the rehearsal of it so not the actual show where like all the famous people go but the rehearsals so you get to see it before anybody else so he got tickets for all to go see that so we're doing that next week which is very exciting what's happened bro Oh, put it back together, it's Lego. It's literal Lego, it goes back together. Lego, man. Yeah, super stressed about it. So, yeah, I'm gonna do some dippy eggs slash mixed up egg in a cup. Good morning, have it's Friday now. The kids have woke up and decided that they're gonna make pancakes. Mm. I'm very happy. Well, Ruben's making Seth some pancakes. So we're just they waiting for them nice. to cook. They smell nice, do they? Yeah. I'm making tea. Me and Adam slept it in. Like, we did not ever sleep in. Like, ever. And we slept in. And when I say slept in, I mean, like, till 
like nine o'clock. I normally wake up at six. I think I did wake up at about it half past six. It's it's I think um, I did sleep it, wake up about ten to six. But my watch was dead and I didn't look at the time and I was like, I'm going to force myself to go back to sleep. And I forced myself to go back to sleep. Right, it's a little bit late. I'm just about to prep dinner. We're having burgers tonight. So I've got some potatoes on to have potato salad. I've done my food. Did I tell you I did my food shop? No, I did my food shop. It was like hell on earth. Quite literally. I still haven't fully put it all away. Grace is ready for gym now. I have to do her hair. So, like, she's got her nice plaits in. Boys are just playing. Mama. You together? Bless you. Mm -hmm. Boys are playing on their computers. What are you playing, Ruben? Star Wars or? Rec room. Rec room. And Seth, Grace slept down here yesterday because she's redoing her room. Seth has signed a den. Oh, hi, Seth. You are right there, mate? Do you like it under there? He's basically just living under there. The sun's really come out now. It's been rain and rainy and drizzly all day, but it's really no, nice no, no, no. now. So I'm going to make my own burgers. So I'm just about to chop some onion up and put it into my burgers. Right, we're back from gymnastics and here's my potato salad and my burger. Grace has got a double burger because the Beyond burgers that she has come in a two pack so I've had to just double up because I can't turn them away. It's absolutely chucking it though. She's not a great start to the summer holidays.